Okay, bent over back fly, very similar to the back fly on the bench, except without, obviously. <laughs> and you are going to put your feet about hips width apart, slight bend in the knees, bending forward from the hips, almost to the point where your torso is parent, uh, parallel with the floor, just a little bit off, maybe about 15 degrees. Tucking your shoulder blades down and back. I'm going to give you three different grips for this. There's going to be semi-supinated, pronated, and neutral. Bring your hips up a little higher, knees back a little bit more, right about there. Good shoulders down and back a little bit. No, just bring, like tuck back a little bit. That's it right there. Okay, so slight bend in the arm, breathing out, coming up, and coming down. So I'm gonna give you an example of a three, zero, one, zero tempo on this. Come up, down, one, two, three, zero at the bottom, one second up, zero at the top, one, two, three. Okay, so that's with a neutral grip. Now we're gonna move into a pronated grip, palms facing back, and you are going to breathe out, come up, and come down. Again, you want to make sure that you're not swinging at all. Your torso is staying tight the entire time. You really want to focus on the movement, working the posterior delt, working the trap, and working the rhomboid. And coming down. So everything is staying steady except your arms moving. Last one, supinated slash semi-supinated grip. Breathing out, coming up and down. Okay, so that is bent over back fly, semi-supinated, neutral, and pronated grip.